A scary morning for all involved in the Ada Borup West School District as a school bus carrying children was hit by a pickup this morning. Four children and an adult were taken to the hospital. Valley News Team's J.C. Dodd was on the scene as crews recovered the bus and pickup and spoke to families with children in that district. My kids ride the Borup bus, so then I'm in a full-blown panic. At 7.30 this morning, the day changed for a group of Ada Borup West parents. A school bus full of students traveling east on 190th Avenue North was hit by a pickup truck hauling a trailer. The Clay County Sheriff says it appears the driver of the pickup failed to yield. Felt like my heart stopped and then I felt like my heart was going 100 miles an hour because that's the road that I live on. That's straight west of me. Babolian's two sons ride the bus to school every morning. It wasn't long before she learned the bus involved wasn't the one her kids were on. But her heart is still broken tonight for the four students taken to the hospital one of them being airlifted. It's bad when it's anybody, but it's even worse when it's kids. It doesn't happen very often, that's for sure. It's really, it's very scary, honestly. The Ada Borup West superintendent says some of the students have serious injuries, but they are non-life threatening. The Clay County Sheriff says the driver of the pickup truck has significant but non-life threatening injuries. Really feeling for those parents right now. That could be my kid or anybody's kid. And I, I really feel sorry for the families that are involved in this. It's it's not, it's kind of tragic actually. I hope they're okay. In Clay County, JC Dodd, Valley News Live. We're also told that other students who were on the bus were picked up by parents or guardians and we're going to continue to update you on the condition of the students as we learn more. Again, one of them airlifted to Fargo at a hospital. Three others were taken to the hospital by ambulance. Dry